Before we get into this video, I remember the previous episode I did show the footage of the news and I all fully aware of what the news said and it just I did see a lot of people saying that the news is attacking on the anime industry and it's just thinking about anime is just for kids like cartoons and I totally disagree about the news of course which I make an edit on the videos in red text and which is not from original by the way because I want to get you guys and girls noted that I'm not defending for news and at the same time I'm trying to be as neutral as I can at that time and because I was taught that the age restriction should be go higher because I understand that the legal age in Japan is 13 years or above and I understand that the game is not for children who is under 13 years old but I just still want to actually like you guys and girls to be prepared for yourself before playing these games because I just feel bad to say like don't play games at all and it just kind of make the game creators I I understand where they come from they want everyone to play games but there will be extra restrictions and I feel sad for uh, people who like underage but I totally aware that they want to play games and nothing gonna stop them no matter what we said and so um, I the best I can do is just um, be prepare yourself for what's coming ahead and when you're underage as well as your um, kind of uh, emotional uh, hittings and something like that so please be prepared for yourself for playing not just in Doki Doki Literature Clubs, not just Doki Doki Blue Skies, but also other uh, games as well. If you are uh, underage, if you are younger than that, please be prepared for yourself because I don't want any one of you guys and girls do anything harm. And uh, yes, I am you know, try to be neutral at that time, but I wasn't said anything uh, clearer in that episode. So um, you guys and girls may lead to misunderstanding and thinking that and defending for the news I'm sorry for that and I just you know um, want to say that clearly as my final conclusion I just want to let uh, videos to be um, laser size um, for good I am not uh, defending for that news at all but at the same time I'm not against uh, the news at all I try to be neutral at that time as the best I can but I totally forgot about um, it when I giving a speech um, in the intro so I, I had to make an addition and trying to make things clearer but sometimes you guys and girls just seeing that the text is only for cover up the copyrights and I did check it doesn't have any copyrights when I using a clip footage on, on the news however I just gonna clip the credit on someone who actually catch the clip anyway and of course there's an addition and saying uh, the curse word I mean obviously like yeah, we all know that um, anime is not just for kids it's also for adults so there will be extra restriction there will be guidance so you guys and girls should read the warnings and should focus on it more so yeah that's all I just want to say and I hope you guys and girls get a better understanding of what I said in, in the previous episode in shows so please you guys and girls read the warning before you play the games as well as if you are having a history of depressions or uh, having like not living thoughts and uh, yes I did uh, share myself that I have a history of depression but um, please be prepared for yourself if you're playing uh, the games that is really hits your heart especially after the episode that I've been uh, going through there's a uh, skip Halloween is the setting for reasons and it's you know, really scary so I want you guys and girls please also check the setting too if you are uh, kind of uh, having uh, like a heart disease uh, or maybe like any disease that uh, can trigger your heart to the point that you may, uh, may pass out so yeah just be uh, please be careful because I know even though that I'm playing the games but I still care about the audience I'm not just playing the games just showing instruction for other people about my choice and as well as just normal gameplay videos but I also as well as a responsibility to actually make sure that you guys and girls audience don't get any like emotional 
uh, hitting too hard as well as uh, doing anything rash afterwards because I understand the game is not the one to blame the blame is our responsibilities we need to be more careful than that and we need to beware about the warning more than that so yeah guys and girls that's it I want to talk about the intro so yeah roll the intro Hey yo, what's up? My name is iPhone and welcome back to Doki Doki Blue Skies. And uh, you already seen that my phone face came more in the intro that I did remind you guys and girls uh, that I didn't uh, fully talk it uh, in uh, to the intro of my previous episodes. That it's not the game's fault, it's your responsibility. And I also have the responsibility to warn you guys and girls also that this game is rated 13 G. So please, if you guys and girls are sensitive with scary stuff uh, as um, I already did in, uh, in the few previous episodes please prepare yourself okay I don't want uh, you guys and girls to do anything rash and also if you my parents out there they uh, having their kids uh, playing uh, uh, anything that is not suitable for uh, the underage which there's sometimes uh, the type of games that have um, PG parental guidance or any age 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18Gs and uh, you need to take care of your uh, children, you need to take care of your kids more even if you're not parents or you are brothers or sisters you, uh, um, you have little siblings please always taking uh, good care of them because you never know I mean uh, I got a uh, uh, fun facts. I uh, have uh, little siblings, and in Vietnam we don't have like uh, age restricted uh, types of things. We do have a warning that there will be the age restriction. Please uh, don't uh, do this uh, before uh, you're at a certain age. Uh, please don't do this if you're uh, underage. But in Vietnam, like mostly people, they don't care because we don't have the laws like that. Nobody control it. So the only thing that is yes depends on is parents and older brothers and sister if you see little siblings or little children do the uh, things that before the certain age please remind them that it is not suitable okay because i don't want anyone of you guys and girls harm and don't blame it into uh, the games they play don't blame it onto their hobbies always explain to them what's right and wrong clear good so let's get into the uh, games and we're gonna check the folders if there's anything change always double check nothing changed yet character still hunky dory and since we already uh, uh, passed the sections in the settings we uh, already passed this section so i'm guessing that this is the only thing that i have to deal with so uh, honestly i don't want to skip anything i just want to be like in the original so i just want to like you know, appreciate the detail appreciate the visualization of the games see it's a visual novel it's like come on like obviously <laughs> so um, yeah let's go back to load games and we can um continue um sir i'm guessing it's a uh, sensei sakurai also I did make a mistake. I did make an edit uh, things uh, in uh, the previous episode. Is is Kokuri? The, uh, is Kokuri San not Kokari San? I mean, uh, like uh, uh, the reason why I make a mistake like that is because like there's a Kokari sweat, I think, and uh, uh, I uh, it's all over in my mind. It just made me forgot about. The name of the game, so I'm apologize for that. It's Kokuri. I don't know if I pronounce this uh, correctly in Japanese. I'm not a Japanese speaker, by the way. So um, yeah, I'm um, sir. Oh, it's Sakurai. I guess that, huh? Oh, I found one nice surprise. What's up? Are you doing anything right now? Technically, no. This is like one uh, day this week. I don't have the meeting. Meetings, taxes, and more meetings. The working world sure is a joy. Yeah, I can imagine. Isn't uh, university fun, though? Um, in my opinions, uh, since I am not uh, a smart person, I am not uh, a genius person, 
Uh, I don't think a university is fun in my opinions, and I think that if you just if I, if for me, for example, I'm not getting good grade at all, and you just repeat the course all, all, all over time for the rest of your life, even when you're old. I mean, ne people never get old to go uh, to college and uh, universities anyway. But honestly, people will just want to have jobs. They just need, you know, don't want to just stick into school like forever. Sometimes uh, they don't. Uh, they really need to uh, have their own life. So sorry, university. I don't think so. It is it right up until finals? Anyway, I was uh, about to head out, but if you wanna talk, let's then let's talk. Oh, are you sure? I just have a couple questions about homeworks. Yes, I'm sure. I don't have any way to be it. Here, take a seat. Also, I want to know more about Shiori and Amy though. They're background characters, but I just want to talk more with them. I mean, come on. Sakurai uh, pulls a chair up near to his desk, motioning uh, for me to see in it. Okay, so I know overproduction was one of the causes for the stock market uh, crash. What's the other one? Oh, good question. Well, it is all about business, isn't it? Let me answer your question with a question. Have you been taking notes at all? Um, uh, obviously, everybody has to take notes, right? Uh-oh. I know you're supposed to be honest with teacher, but how exactly do you tell them you haven't been taking notes? Your silence speaks volumes, I found. I begin, think I begin to sink down in my seat. He got me. He got me good. <laughs> Sakura just chuckles. <laughs> don't worry, I found. I know how boring taking notes is. I, I, For me, in real life, I don't. I always uh, enjoy taking notes. I mean, come on, I'm a uh, kind of parrot. Uh, uh, types of studies, I have mm, a way to take notes and then when I get home, I know where I'm going and I just put it in my, my brain and then on the very next day, the teachers ask mm, uh, uh, something for revision you know how to answer uh, don't worry, I find no boring thing you is I don't think so though I was in high school mm, low once too, you know of course, if you develop a habit of take, not taking notes you'll be like me and barely end up graduating on time oh so, um, uh, can I have a question, Sakurai? What's make you a teacher? Uh, how can you get this job? This is interesting. Your boss fail? <laughs> Are you kidding me? I was almost failed my entire third year. Wow, same here, <laughs> I guess. I finally learned how to uh, take a good notes in uh, university. That was a uh, hard way though. Just me, it's better uh, to learn uh, not uh, than to learn in the real world. Do you want me to slow down a bit with that help? What? No, no, that, the pace is perfectly fine. i just a bit lazy. I can't relate to that too much. Another share laugh. Now, to finally answer your question, the main reasons the stock market crash was overproductions and installment buy. Installment buy. Oh. That's a good one. Because I remember there's uh, actually overstock, and then uh, people uh, don't buy enough uh, of your stuff, and then it, it just because you're like you're wasting money, and uh, installment buying though, yeah, that uh, also effect. That's like credit card, yeah, precisely. Anyway, the stock market crashed on October 29th, 1929, also known as. Oh, that's a um, uh, around time in the World War One and World War Two, and that's pretty much why the 1930 was such an unstable decade. Yeah, I can remember that. Like it's uh, around a uh, really hard time when people you know, start the World War. I think. Does that all make sense? Yeah, it does. Thank you, sir. The quality is much uh, appreciated. Okay, I'm always happy to have students, especially when they take an initiative you know, to see me after lessons. It happens less than you think. Anyway, I'm gonna get going. See you tomorrow. Have a good day, sir. Honestly, like, uh, I'm actually in interested in history. I know like a lot of people out there, they, they have a different opinions. They don't like histories and they just you know, telling me that I'm a boring person. But no, I'm all about respect. I mean, uh, come on. 
those people are uh, the one who makes you today. And uh, I mean, uh, history is not that bad. Yes, there is uh, a lot for you to take in notes. However, if you like uh, work hard, if you uh, uh, just taking enough notes, and when you got home, you put all those uh, notes inside your brain and for the memorizations. And then when you get into a test, they ask the questions, and then you put uh, what you know into uh, uh, the test. And that's an easy high grade, in my opinion. I mean, sometimes teachers uh, don't take it as seriously, like all 100%, but uh, they understand that you know history, you know uh, how to answer the questions. And then and they decide that, hey, even though that it's not 100% precisely, but you still have good score anyway, that's all that matters. So yeah, that's in my opinion, for those who are not a history fan out there, I'm, I'm not a history fan either, but uh, why do I have a good grade you know, on history? It's because of taking notes, that's why. With that, I take my back and uh, head you know, for literature clubs. I know Natsuki is probably gonna be mad that I'm late, but I say it's worth it. Starting to agree like Sakura, hey? I'm sorry, Natsuki. There's um, different types of sensei. He's the first teacher I've ever really connected with. I like the guy, and it seems he's like me too. At least I hope so. <laughs> Opening the door to the literature clubs, I see Yuri, Sayori, and Manika at the front of the room. Natsuki isn't anywhere to be seen though. Oh my god, yeah, I did something wrong, I still remember in the previous episode, we did artwork things, but actually in the price side, we get you know, the chance to make bento each other though. I also met a look uh, uh, up the food, it's actually the egg roll spinach, but again, I'm really forgetful, I forgot the original names, the, it's uh, kind of the... Um, uh, Spinach that you maybe either uh, already boiled or maybe you uh, not uh, uh, even make it yet, but you're still uh, using a chopped spinach and you're trying to make an egg rolls uh, and um, with your uh, spinach inside. You can uh, use a different type of vegetable though, it's basically like egg roll with vegetables. But I don't know, I, I look up on social media, I look up on the internet and try to know about the food. It's actually more complex than that, than you think. Opening the door to literature, go see Yuri, but cannot see Natsuki. Hey guys, hi iPhone. Hey iPhone, you'll be late today, something coming up. Oh, oh yeah, uh, oh, there you are, where were you? I'm sorry. Natsuki's sudden interjection startles me. Jeez, where did you come from? The class is dull. Where did you come from? I was just talking to the teacher about homework. Obviously, I am not doing something uh, like teaching uh, um, uh, others, like teaching you. Uh, Natsuki eyes me suspiciously. What's that look for? You know what it's for. No, I don't. Let's see, shakes her head and walks them back to the classes. Hey, I'm serious. Uh huh, sure. Where exactly do you think uh, I, uh, come, uh, I came from then, huh? Good question. I'm not gonna ditch you anyway, Natsuki. But uh, there are some times in the situation where I need to deal with which one is right and wrong. I'm sorry, I have not to uh, ditch you. Um, uh, and pick Monica instead because th at that time I think about logically you are wrong Natsuki but just let the past go away just don't annoy uh, about that too much okay well I think that uh oh something break I rushed over the closet trying to figure out the shots to crash my surprise like sir does I see ceramic pieces scattered all over the floor? Oh no, is she gonna chip over? Is that? What was that noise? Monica calls me from the other side of the room. It was Yuri's tea set. My god, this is bad. The rest of the girls rush over to the closet. Oh no, Natsuki, did you broke it? Monica and uh, Sayori both look nervous and Yuri. I'm not really sure how to describe her face. I mean, I can see 
I see she is a little bit small, but I think she feels sad. That's what I'm thinking. No, it's just a dust in my screen. Is <laughs> she actually look uh, sad? There's no smile in her face. <sighs> I'm sorry. She looks um, uh, absolutely devastated. Yet she seems uh, about three seconds away from doing that thing, Nasky. I can see her uh, facing Titan with every passion seconds. Girls, there's no need to fight. Fight, fighting don't solve anything. Yuri, Aham, Nasuki averts her eyes. It was an honest accident. Yeah, I, I think it's, I, I totally agree. I think it's an accident. I'm sure it was. There's a sort of restrained quality to Yuri's voice, like she's holding something back. Is that he said expensive? Oh no, I'm guessing it. Oh my god, I swear I. <sighs> I'm guessing it because I remember Yuri like using a tea set that is kind of ancient or antique or anything. Oh no. It would be a good idea for actually uh, uh, the literature clubs actually having part-time job, right? I mean, of course we still like in games in uh, we still students, but I did see some animes that they still allow students to actually have part-time jobs. He says cost six thousand eight hundred yen. That's so expensive because I I I know that uh, Japanese. Oh, Japan is a really expensive country. I don't mean to offend, but I'm really sorry. But uh, yeah, sometimes that uh, they do have complain that uh, they uh, don't earn enough for just a day. It's really sad. Yuri pauses, and I um, can almost see hear her grinding her teeth. And if you don't mind, I'd like for you to pay for it. Yeah, I think it's the best solution. Are you kidding me? I don't have that kind of money. Then, uh, as of your know, parents, but then you should you know, be more careful. Yuri has a fire in her eyes now, comparable only to an argument on my second day in the club. Uh oh. Oh my god, do I have to pick a choice again? Natsuki doesn't uh, look like she's backing down though. This is gonna get ugly. Yeah, you dang right. Dialogue. Hey, I said I was sorry. Can you be more sincerely? If I remember correctly, you said it was an honest accident. There was no mention of an apology yet. Oh my god! Jesus Christ! Since when you make uh, this animation? Oh my god! She looks so angry. But she was right. There's no more apology mentioned. Fine then, I'm sorry that you're happy. It's not sincerely. Can you just... Be nice. Yuri scops. Just what I expect from someone uh, as ex uh, ego 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 and narrow minded as you. And I'm by English. Uh, it's never your phone, is it? It's always the other person who has phone and there's wrongdoing, not yours. It's an honest mistake. I, I said that, did I not? Or were you not listening? Natsuki clenches at fist, but Yuri's stares and becomes even more icy. They are really going at it, aren't they? The last time I interjected on the argument uh, was this festival, so I think it's the best if I step this one out. Was I not listening? My goodness, your self-centered arrogance knows no bounds. Or I asked for, for the was an apology and for you to repay me for the tea set. See that is that too much to ask? Yes, it's expensive, but can we at least be smart away be smart about this? Saying sorry sincerely and then uh, trying uh, to figure out, you know, asking your parents. And yet you treat me like this simply uh, asking for repair uh, reparation. Face it, you spoil egotistical uh, B words. Jesus Christ, you go hard. 
I don't have 7,000 yen. Why am I a bad guy for not being rich? Because you break things. Yes, it's an accident, but you unfortunately have to repay. Excuse me if my parents aren't rich. The fire in uh, Yuri's eyes dims slightly when Natsuki mentions her parents. She shrugs it off and the fire erupts again, more intense than before. Why is it so hard for you to apologize? Even when you're blatantly at phone, you still struggle to admit it. Because that, that most of the girls who are in Sundari types, they don't admit themselves for something, so it's hard for them to apologize. That was, that's what I'm guessing. Instead, you throw blame onto others because you're too immature and to apologize for a normal human. I'm in major. I wasn't the one who started the whole argument just because I found in like uh, my poetry. Looks like we've come full circle. Great. You still hung up on that? My goodness, you're insecure about po your poetry. Shut the heck up. I think that's okay. You, uh, you're the one who actually shut the heck up. Stop. So you're certain the interjection startles everyone in the room. Come on guys, please! Oh my god, now she's crying. You guys arguing is uh, what, uh, tearing, uh, this, uh, what tearing uh, these clubs apart. I hate it when we fight. I love you guys and seeing this just hurt. Singer begins to uh, tear up. Can we please stop? Yuri, I know you're mad that Natsuki broke your tea set. Natsuki, I know you're mad uh, that Yuri is mad. God, can you just Natsuki? And uh, can you say sorry uh, one more times, but be more sincerely? And then uh, who knows? Can figure this out. Parents, if your parents doesn't have enough money to repay these girls, at least who knows? Get a job. But just a part-time job be fine. But why do we always to argue with each other? Well, because it's uh, Yandere and Sundere, and they all have the uh, comments as a dere as the end, but the difference is the Su and Yan, and they have different uh, personalities, and they just simply easy uh, to fight each other, and it's just not fit for them. That's what I'm thinking, but my god. We are friends, why can't we act like this? Natsuki and Yuri look at the ground with shame. Sayuri so is still trying foolishly to suppress her tears. Manika walks up near behind her and places uh, reassuring hands on her shoulders. After what seems near like an eternity, Natsuki finally speaks. Yuri, I'm sorry. There we go. That's what um, we need. <laughs> I am I really. It's just. Money is kind of sensitive topic. Yuri looks up meeting Natsuki gaze. I I understand. Perhaps we could divide the cost 50-50. Yeah, that could uh, be an idea. You're willing to do that? Like 6,800 yen? Like 3,400? 3, I mean, uh, I think that's enough for Natsuki. Yuri nuts. Yeah, 50-50, that sounds good. I'm uh, sorry for being mean. I didn't mean it. I must apologize as well. I lost my temper and lashed out of you. Yeah, you did go hard there. I hope you can forgive me. You're forgiven, Yuri. As are you, Natsuki. Sometimes I don't understand why I click into a mouse and it just delay The dialogue. See? See, this is so much better. I'm glad Nyagi is a good work things out. It makes me happy. So you're grasping Nyagi and Natsuki pulling out into a tight group hugs. Wow. I think they deserve it. Just to calm them down. Ah, that's, that's enough, Sayori. Natsuki pulls her away from the group, rubbing her neck. Jeez, you almost choked me to death. It's a deck. Yeah, I'm still safe. <laughs> Show me to not leaving. I mean, uh, some uh, sometimes when I uh, go uh, uh, studying abroad in USA, before that, uh, my parents always 
and like hug me before I leave. I don't like that because they always choke me like real hard. I try to uh, I tell them to stop, but no. Honestly, like my God. No, uh, not just my parents, but also my little sibling as well. I mean, but I understand my little sibling is just uh, my primary is primary school and still uh, naive and still uh, kind of uh, love to have fun. But I don't like it when people hug me to the point that they choke me. It's so annoying. You almost choked me to not leaving. <laughs> Sorry, I guess I got a bit carried away. <laughs> There's no need to apologize, Sayori, your horse was in the right place and that's what matters. I can't help but smile to myself how quickly that fight was broken up. On first glance, you think that the apology was insincere, but now the way I see it, why Yuri and Natsuki uh, but has uh, every now and again. I don't really think there's any real ill will between them. Yeah, in the hidden moment stuff gets said, stuff that makes uh, the hostility seem more exaggerated than it actually is. But in my time with uh, Natsuki has taught me uh, anything, yeah, she can uh, be intimidating, but she can also be all bark and not so much bite. <laughs> anyway, when we, uh, people are, like Sayori around, you can always uh, race easy knowing that any fight will be quickly dealt with. Either way, the grub is uh, uh, is best when it's just us having fun, like the Halloween party. But I don't think I'm having fun in the Halloween party. I mean, uh, please, guess I'm gonna try to say it right. Don't play Kakuri's uh, uh, games. Don't play Charlie Charlie games. Don't play Sister Sister games. Don't play Yuji board games. They're dangerous. It's full of disrespectful for people who already passed away. Don't be like that uh, type of social media influencer who always uh, scares uh, with a uh, YouTube board. Don't, okay, just don't. Seeing everyone getting a long put a smile on my face. Alright, someone needs to clean this up. I found you do it. No, you break it, you do it. What, why me? Because I don't want to do it. Really? Natsuki, you break it, you do it. The girls share a chuckled. I really don't feel like arguing except after all that. <sighs> Fine. Really games. I think uh, Natsuki will be better to clean. I was choking iPhone. I can do it. See? Nah, it's up. Alright, ah. Uh, Natsuki reaches into a closet and pulls us a broom. You know what? Let's do it together. I'm doing it. Alright then. Go ahead. Go right ahead. Natsuki begins cleaning up the tea set while the rest of the girls go back to their usual business. Guess I can read for a bit. What else is there to do? I mean, rip off eight girls after Natsuki uh, cleaning this up. But please, 50 50, remember this, okay? 3,400 yen. Don't forget. Well, that's just about wrapping up, isn't it? Good meeting today. Guys, I saw a lot of good discussion. I'll see everyone on Monday. Enjoy the weekends. With that, the girls and I begin to pack up. Natsuki and I uh, had uh, decided to make uh, working home together as a routine things. Wait, I thought Sayori. W now with Natsuki and I? Wait, hold on. Since when Sayori decided to go uh, home alone? Is that would be better for Natsuki and Sayori uh, and I uh, work home together? It's nice spending uh, just a bit more time with uh, her, but I can't help uh, thinking about what Sayori said back in September about all about this. See? Should I ditch someone? I forget uh, how I, I had answered her, to be honest, but I, uh, I answered that like, uh, I go for Natsuki. But regarding if I'm uh, keeping my word or not, Natsuki and I were uh, working home together. Hey, can you hurry up? Hold on, I'm almost done. How hard uh, is it to pack your, up your stuff? I mean, I uh, since I don't like lockers, so I just mostly put uh, everything in my bag and just go home and go to school. Like it just, um, I get used to it. I mean, don't judge me. I'm the type of uh, person who don't like using lockers. I mean, who knows? When you get into a class, you forgot stuff in the lockers, and then it's just waste on other people's time. It's just annoying, and. Yeah, yeah. How do you think? 
So then what I did that I finished before you huh? Your first year you can't talk. Natsuki chops me in the arm. I expected that as much. I learned that if you make a jokes about Natsuki high age or manga taste, you're getting smacked in some way or another. Of course I prefer it when it's used to in a joking manners. Ow, you deserve it. The eye though. Natsuki rolls her eyes at me. You're an idiot. Yeah, yeah, I'm a bad guy. I finally finished packing up and joined Natsuki at the door. See ya. Natsuki wasting at the girls, I do the same. Wait, I thought we... I thought we go home uh, together. Bye guys. Chane, Monica. You're in Sayori Wasting Silence. It says something's wrong. I noticed a sort of sad smile on Sayori's face. See? I, th I think it would be better if Sayori is also joining uh, with uh, uh, Natsuki and I too, right? The smile ingrains itself in my brain. Natsuki and I start uh, for her house. Did she want to walk home with me? Is that it? If so, uh, then I just ditch her. Great, now I feel bad. I don't oh my god, why is things uh, becoming black and white now? Not luckily, but uh oh. Also, and the, even the skies is fit uh, the atmosphere though, like it's so cool. Can we appreciate uh, the visualization of the weather based on the original scene? Why didn't she say anything? Was she just too shy or she maybe didn't want to hurt Natsuki's feeling? Why a lot of things? Uh, hey, you good? Natsuki finger snaps right in front of my face. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, sorry. I was spaced out. <laughs> Natsuki eyes at me suspiciously. I was just thinking about Sayori. Sayori? Yeah, we've been trying to hang out more like we used to. So, you know. Yeah, sure. Huh, is this frustration written over her face after what you did with Yuri? <laughs> was it because I mentioned hanging out with Sayori? Yeah, probably. Oh, I have an idea. She loved this. Hey, Natsuki. What? You wanna go hang out or at the library? Oh, that's a good idea. Uh... Depends on Suddenly Natsuki stops not living in her tracks. We right near her house. I wonder what's got her intention attentions uh, Is that her parents? There's nothing out of ordinary from what I see There's a car in her driveway, but that's it. Yeah, let's go to the library Natsuki make a 180 and uh, begins walking in the opposite direction. I chill behind her I will question her further, but she seemed irritated or something. I I, I would yeah, guess it's a parents because sometimes parents uh, don't want uh, your uh, children to uh, go hang out with uh, someone that is, is opposite genders. But uh, for me, I I don't mind. But most uh, parents are so protective, and I don't like uh, that to happen. Can you just please at least give uh, more freedom to your children? Pushing Natsuki never ends well. Do you have a volume of red items? Ah, crap. Oops, I did. I haven't thought that. I thought uh, that we're still continuing perfect girls. <laughs> Sorry, I thought it slipped my mind. They have everything in there. We have it at the library, I'm sure. Yeah, but the library's copies are tons of them worn. Yeah, sometimes too. Your aunt. We are taking care of my manga. Unlike those low life sa savages. <laughs> yeah. Sorry librarians, you need to uh, check out in the books more often. I mean, sometimes when your books is old, you need to replace it. And honestly, most of the school libraries, they don't do that, uh, unfortunately. It's just, and once they buy the books, that's it, just give it for years and then um, make it like a, uh, libraries. I mean, come on, libraries is not just mm, a full of books. Can you please at least replace books? Uh, like every single year? <sighs> you can say that again. The first novel in the series is always uh, the most worn. But because people who never handle manga in their life will take it out trying to get to, into it. And then uh, they read left to right. Uh, I mean uh, some of the manga in Japan, like, I guess it's mostly like they read from right to left. At first, I, 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 I get greedy at first, but 
uh, like sooner or later since I understand how or it actually read. Well, sure. Amateurs. Shh shh shh. Let's get and I can't have a laugh. <laughs> ah, here we are. The skin is already I'm freezing. It's not that cold, but I got a feeling what if there is going to be rain. So the guy was born uh, on winter uh, jacket. Well, I mean a jacksuit, but still. Uh, this uh, is uh, a very comfortable jacket. I will have you know. Same here. Sometimes I am mostly wearing jacket just to look cool. But however, when I go into USA studying abroad, it's always getting cold in, uh, in um, my opinions, and it's just uh, I always having to wear jacket even with indoors. When I go back uh, in Vietnam, honestly, I just you know, only wear something cool like just a normal shirt and a short. Uh, and sometimes if I want to look cool, I just wearing jacket outside. I mean, sometimes jacket has a benefit that it just and, and it just uh, cover up your whole face and trying to avoid your sun getting to your face and just ruin your face. But yeah, this comfortable jacket and let you know. And yes, it is very everywhere insulated. As we walk into a library, we pass a bunch of uh, vending machines. One machine in particular uh, catches my eyes. Ooh, coffee! I could go over some uh, right about now. I like coffee, obviously. I mean, uh, uh, I, uh, I don't know how coffee actually uh, uh, makes me f uh, feel awake. I just m uh, mostly drink coffee just for a taste because uh, it just makes you feel like really calm. Especially, I like hot coffee more. I don't like cold coffee. I mean, I understand Vietnam is a uh, humidity is the country and people are mostly uh, drinking cold uh, coffee just be, you know, to be cool. However, I just want the original coffee and it has to be hot because you know, you want to stay calm and you just want to think about uh, your past, think about uh, your, uh, your sadness in the past and you're just thinking about what you can do better in the future, thinking about uh, yeah, uh, about what you uh, you're going to do better next. I mean, that's what I love about coffee. I just really love to drink something that can help me comfort my, myself and just you know, trying to forget about real life, relax. I mean, yeah, coffee. I could get some right now. Coffee? Well, unless you don't drink tea. Same. I mean, I actually uh, drink uh, tea. Uh, sometimes I drink teas, but not much. I mostly only drink like deep tea, as uh, you uh, uh, see in, in, uh, in this social media in my channels already. And I did try to drink lime tea, and uh, there's a person in the comments saying that it's too much lime. And uh, honestly, I'm the type of person who really likes sweet, sour, and I want to like drinking something that is. Uh, full of flavor and it just go over my mouth more clearly but yeah everyone has a different taste be uh, um, because like some people want to be serious people want to be balanced and it's okay you can actually uh, uh, try to reduce the um, ingredients for your drinks but for me that I'm the type of person who actually want the flavors to be clearly into my mouth so uh, and it's understandable if uh, some people don't like uh, when I put too much stuff in a, a drink, especially I did you know, one with the tea. Honestly, uh, I remember the tea that still tastes really nice. It's uh, still showing the flavors of the lambs uh, in the tea. I mean, uh, it's a deep tea anyway. <laughs> well, at least you don't drink tea. What's wrong with coffee? Uh, it's too bland. You need a million different things to make it taste good. For example, milk. I think uh, when you drink coffee, if you don't get used to the really bland one like Americano, yeah, you can actually add dense milk. I sh you can actually add normal milk uh, if you want to, but I think like it would be better for dense milk uh, because it has uh, more amount of sugars and uh, it just uh, helps you to actually balance the um, uh, flavors of the sweetness and uh, the blandness of the coffee and uh, you can actually you know, put fresh sugar if you want but for me whenever I drink coffee I really put like to put dense milk and it's uh, really nice I'm not gonna lie and uh, yeah yeah the million things make good 
I prefer hot chocolates. I mean, hot chocolate is still fine too. Ah, respect that type of choice. Hot chocolate is good, but uh, like uh, the caffeine. Yeah, it's the one uh, to actually help you waking up. But for me, I'm uh, just a type of person who uh, always waking up anyway. But I just uh, like to uh, drink coffee as a taste. But sometimes drinking too much coffee is not good. And uh, if you drink too much coffee, the mild caffeine will just gonna ruin your like blood flows into your heart, and it just you get heart attack. Please don't drink too much coffee, okay? Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Don't drink too much coffee. Just uh, uh, try to get enough sleep. Drink coffee like uh, especially in the morning or in the afternoon. Don't drink it at night. Coffee is a bad idea for night time. It's, uh, well, except for people who night shifting though. And yeah, black coffee is disgusting. I agree. I honestly yeah, yeah, agree because I did try Americano before. It's way too bland. I'm not gonna lie. I uh, like uh, uh, tasting coffee as an original. I did uh, taste cappuccino. I did taste uh, mocha. I did taste uh, like caramel macchiatos. I did uh, taste. Like, look, I did even try to uh, drink like the uh, three uh, large cups of coffee in live streaming in my uh, social media, in my other social media actually. And I didn't expect that it would that bad. So, yeah, please don't drink too much coffee. People who drink it is probably psychopath. No, really. I don't, I don't think uh, people drink black coffee is a psychopath, but yeah, you can actually drink that because you can actually think that because uh, you, know, you cannot uh, drink uh, something that other people uh, uh, actually can. I mean, I can say that uh, you know, people who drink black coffee are totally crazy, but it's not to the point that they psychopath go to insane asylums. But yeah, nasty laughs. <laughs> That seems about right. Here, I can get the table. You can get your coffee. So, Natsuki, what do you want to drink? Natsuki walks out, leaving me alone at the machines. What to get, what to get. The coffee sounds so good uh, right about now. The machine is being slower than usual, so Natsuki managed to find a seat and come back now before I have my coffee. we right over there. Natsuki points to the table at, at the other end of the room. Got it. Coffee in hand. I walk over to the table and brought my stuff down. Natsuki chose me shortly thereafter. What kind of coffee did you get? Oh, that's a good question. French vanilla with cream and sugar. You know, thank you, sure. Oh my god. Sometimes I don't like when I uh, 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 go to like the coffee shop. I, I have to actually telling the full name of the coffee. It's so hard. I mean, if I having to order any coffee, I just basically saying that uh, cappuccino, uh, which uh, how which what size, and then uh, if you want any whipped cream or some things, and then uh, just be done. I mean, name the types of coffee, and then uh, uh, which size, and then be done with it. Obviously, I mean, my God, French vanilla with cream and sugars. Cream, cream. I prefer with dense milk, but yeah, you can actually cream. Cream still works. Normal milk still works. But I mean, I'm guessing it's vanilla latte. What kind of coffee do you drink? I'm a fan of caramel, to be honest. Same here. Same here, caramel macchiato lovers. My God, Nasuki, you're such my favorite. Caramel like coffee with caramel sauce or caramel flavor coffee. No, it's like a, a what? How to put it? Like caramel puddings, and then uh, it's you can say it's a sauce for those who don't actually uh, know much about pudding. But yeah, you also call caramel macchiato lovers. My God, Nasuki, more like Daisuki. <laughs> What's the difference? I just said that the difference. Yeah, whatever. It tastes the same anyway. I I don't think it, it tastes the same. Caramel macchiatos focus on caramel, but vanilla lattes is basically focus on milk. 
that's what I'm thinking because you know, mostly people think it's about the v uh, vanilla flavor milk and uh, that's pretty much it and it just uh, doesn't have much uh, of the sweetness I did try it in the live stream and I didn't expect cappuccino is just not taste much and I was uh, a little bit disappointing and uh, uh, caramel macchiato stay full of flavor is sweetness everything I got Natsuki good choice I, but I don't think it's taste the same. Cof and there's a different types of coffee. It's different types of coffee though. Well, there's probably a slight difference. Okay, name Mr. Coffee Expert. Yeah. I guarantee I drink a lot of coffees. Different types uh, of coffee. I can uh, recognize it. Uh, 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 different taste. Fine, fine. I'm just saying. Let's get rose of eyes. You're about to second away from getting smack. Um, you know what, Natsuki, I'm getting used to it. You know what, I'm just gonna take a smack. Oh yeah, let's see it then, shorty. That's mean. Shut up. I love but Natsuki doesn't. <laughs> uh oh, I may have struck a nerve there. <laughs> I should probably apologize. Alright, that was a bit nerve on my part, my bad. Yeah, sometimes girls don't like to talk about heights and weight. Natsuki, that... Yeah, Claire tones down a bit, but she still seems agitated. You know what? Let's go with it. Are you really that self-conscious about your height? I mean, come on. Honestly, most girls, they don't like to talk about height and weight, and especially the chest size. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, uh, obviously, I can tell the truth that I like the girls with hit and with uh, some smaller upper body. But uh, sometimes uh, girls uh, just sing as a bluff. I mean, it's sad. I mean, I try to be honest, but you know what? Uh, they just thinking me I'm the p-word right now. <laughs> just get a verse of eyes thing out of window at the falling snow. Oh, wait, really? The stillness up in the library only works to make the air even more tense. After what seems like an eternity, she sighs and turns back on me. But gaze strips into the ground still not meeting mine. Yeah. It's like... Is there something sad uh, that related to her height? She shakes her head. I don't know. I don't know why I'm so conscious or why I should be, but I am. I'm only a first year, but I'm still one of the smallest girls in uh, the school. Don't say that. You never know. It's... Once again, she turns to look out over the windows. Ugh, you wouldn't understand. I understand, my parents always judging uh, my eyes all the time, like, uh, I understand, most girls only into uh, boys with uh, a really tall height. For me, I'm just uh, not even 1 meter 7. Hontoni, <laughs> really, I'm not even 1 meter 7. And uh, I was like, just screw it, I understand how it feel, I mean, uh, heights and weight is not uh, a competition. I mean, uh, uh, yeah, obviously, uh, there's people who uh, wants uh, the types of people to be more fitness, but for me, that just live with the attitude. Honestly, just live with the attitude, that's all that matters. Uh, you wouldn't understand. Sorry. I do get where you're coming from, though. Well, if it's uh, any consolation, anyone who thinks that's because, unless you because of your size, is a complete idiot. You're a great person, Natsuki. You're a great boy, and even a better cook. How tall you are doesn't change any of that. Yeah, that's right. It doesn't matter. Just leave me by yourself. Just leave me be nice. She turns around looking at me in the eyes. Do you really mean that? Yeah, I do, obviously. Of course I do, I know why. Why? Because it's the truth, that's why. See? Height, yeah, weight doesn't matter. Size doesn't matter. Just be yourself. Just be in the attitude that you deserve. Just be your personalities. Once again, Natsuki avoids her case. She has a facial expression that can't quite make out the meaning of. We both sip our respective drinks in silence. Suddenly, I have an idea. Yo, Natsuki. Yeah. Can I see your hot chocolate? She raises an eyebrow and as soon as she tightens her grips in on the cups. Why exactly? I have an idea, trust me. Oh, is that looking at the coffee fortune? Reluctantly, Natsuki slices of hot chocolate across the table. I take the caps up and begin pouring in my coffee. Hey, what are you doing? 
Oh my god, are we gonna drink the, the same drink together? That's so, that's so sweet. Snatching and snatching her cup by cousin me to spill some coffee on the tables. What the heck was that for? Try it. I motioned to her cups. Uh, now, Nasuki. This is not the indirect kiss. It you drink from the other side, so don't worry, okay? Uh, reluctantly, she slowly raises uh, the cup up to her lips and takes a sip. Her eyes quickly widen. Holy crap! Is it good? She has me the cup and uh, I take the sweet. But it's actually mu much better than I thought it would be. <laughs> I'm a genius. I thought you were the first person to combine coffee and hot chocolate. I think you can actually combine uh, coffee together. Of this, imagine. I never tried this before, but imagine. Cappuccino would combine with... Um, who knows? Espresso. <laughs> That's, I'm guessing, but I don't know if that's gonna work, but yeah. Imagine Grandma Macchiato will like combine with um, mocha. I mean, they both sweet though. But my god. I mean, combining thing is not a bad idea, come on, just like cooking. I mean, you cannot just cook in one ingredient, you can cook into two ingredients or more. There's actually some people can even uh, cook uh, something really nice just only using two ingredients. Like, uh, seriously. I mean, you, you can actually cook an egg with only one ingredient, but my god, why not trying some other uh, thing uh, like a uh, mix too? Like, for example, the uh, food that uh, I looked up uh, from the previous episode the egg rolls, but with vegetables on it. Look how healthy was that! I mean, it, it takes time to know. Hey, you never know. Let's get her eye and take it, uh, take it back her cups. Hey, excuse me, this is my drink. I'm not sharing. Uh, come on, please, please. Let's get not so bad. Go get your own drink. I have my own drink. Then why uh, do you want mine? Yours is hot chocolate. <laughs> so you admit hot chocolate is better than coffee? Uh, see? There's no need to discriminate. Crap. I told you so. Yeah, yeah. Keep rubbing it in. I will, thank you. All that sugar is going to your head, isn't it? <laughs> God, you sounds like my... Your dad. My God. I mean, uh... That's true, though. Every time I, you know, treating my little siblings, I, I sounds like uh, dad either. So I don't want to cheat like... The relationship between brothers or sister because I don't want uh, the outsider to uh, make a misunderstandings. I just like well, wanting to cheat and my little uh, siblings. And like, uh, actual like, this one. <laughs> it's embarrassing to say, but come on. I mean, uh, someday uh, you get older, people. Uh, probably be mothers and fathers. You're gonna act like one of them. I mean, you cannot be brothers and sister forever. But uh, I mean, I understand. If you want to be a brothers and sister forever, like it means that like, you want to hang out with them like more often. But being like parents, it takes more responsibilities. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, uh, because my little siblings are a big fan of uh, Crayon Shinchan. Uh, as a manga uh, and uh, the TV show as well. Uh, uh, for me, even though I'm old enough, I ch even though how hard I try to not uh, let them to see uh, the animes, uh, Crayon Shin-chan or the manga, even though they're underage. And my parents be like, "Yeah, that's a kids show. They, uh, it's not a big deal." I was like really annoyed about it, but you cannot stop uh, other people from what they are doing. Uh, um, what uh, they love doing, I mean, there's no choice, but uh, I just want to make sure that they uh, get more responsibility. I mean, I have a lot uh, of little siblings and they are uh, already primary school and they already have experience to actually discover cartoon uh, and animes, mangas and stuff. I mean, unfortunately, Vietnam uh, is uh, a country that we don't have the age restriction. We still have the warning, but most of the people, they don't care. You do understand why Vietnam is one of the uh, countries that search a lot. Uh, uh, 
H uh, animation anime <laughs> the most <laughs> you must drink hot milk chocolate out from then yeah I wish that uh, is uh, a stickler about food is so annoying let me guess is this uh, sad because uh, uh, Natsuki you're a good cook but uh, your parents being bossy that's why I say sticker about food. That same way, at least he was. Oh, um, sorry, I guess. Uh, oh no, no, it's not that he's not, uh, he's not not leaving. My parents are divorced. That's all. I get a feeling it happens to me uh, twice. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. Divorce is hard, man. And then afterward, uh, you don't know where to go. Oh, okay. And especially parents don't even think about children after all. I mean, uh, they get uh, the worst effect after the divorce and they just don't know where to go. They don't know where to go to school. They don't know where to make friends. And they had to witness the breakup. It just hurt their mental so much. That's why my mom ne is never home. She always out on business trips nowadays. Pretty much live by myself. Mm, luckily, I'm thrilled to live alone. Eh, it's not uh, as glamorous as it seems. It actually gets pretty lonely. Yeah, you said something about that before the festival. Is that why? Pretty much. I've always been so loner. It's, it's not that I'm not a social person. It's just I never really feel like making friends, you know. Oh my god, this is so deep. This hits me hard, man. It's actually real. I, I'm i not you know, social. I always get shy. Especially uh, when I'm going offline to uh, meet with some uh, people who playing the same games, I'm not as social uh, people like us like uh, uh, to just to greet uh, hello to literally everyone and trying to see them playing uh, 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 games and then uh, trying to talk about discuss uh, how the games works and then uh, how the systems are going. But man, in real life. It's really hard to making friends in real life, you know, like even people who play in the same games because you don't see them often, they don't live nearby you, you uh, if you want to uh, have a chance to meet them, you have to travel by uh, your bike and motorbike or cars, or even, uh, yeah, it's a time of the age that I don't uh, get uh, to go to school anymore because, yeah, I'm, f I'm totally done. I mean, I'm 20 years of age, man. My god, it's, it's, re it's really sad. And uh, back when I was secondary school, childhood, I you know, don't feel like making friends because bullies, discriminations. I feel really lonely back then. I al always only talking to uh, the girls who are classmates. And uh, people just you know, keep always give me a misunderstanding like what if I'm going transgender, don't worry I'm not, okay? But I, it doesn't mean that I'm not supporting uh, like people who are in the, the community are homos, but I'm actually a straight person, but it's just really complicated and really sad, you know? But yeah, I, I can totally feel this, I've been loner for many times. And yeah, when I was in secondary school, I was a total a-hole. And uh, it's just sad, man. Yeah, I understand. Siri so was like my only child friend, and even then we drifted apart. Joining the literature club was actually a pretty big step for me. Didn't Siri really, like drag uh, you to the club or something? Now I joined willingly, and I get to hang out with you, so I say it was worth it. Totally different from the original games. Uh, that's good. Chicks suddenly turn bright color of red. Y uh, you? Yeah, sure, whatever. Aww. You're really nice. I mean, in real life, like, sometimes being too nice, like, it just you know, make other people's bored quickly. It's really sad, man. Haha, <laughs> thanks, I try. Thank you for that. No need to thank me. Really, it's my pleasure. Oh, before I forget, I was serving Yuri's tea set. That, don't remind me. Yeah, don't forget about that, you still have to pay. 
it was an honest accident, but she just overreacted, just just like she always sort of does. <laughs> yeah, not always actually. Now that I think about it, what are you saying exactly? I don't know. I was just thinking about it, and I realized that Yuri and I really starting to not like each other around the time when you join. Oh my god, you want to be friend with Yuri again? Yeah, I noticed that too. What, you knew Yuri before the clubs? No, I don't. Oh, no, not that I was saying I noticed that you two were starting fighting when I joined the club. Yeah, I never understood Yuri. She always been kind of arrogant, especially about literature. This always annoys me, but I never brought her up. Except mm -hmm. for that time, but that's just because she took me off. God. I don't like just going up to people and saying stuff like that. I only do it when they it make me mad, you know. This is so deep. Yeah, I noticed that about you. Guys, so deep. It hits me hard, man. Yeah, I, I uh, did have the history of my uh, getting uh, depressions. And uh, yes, I in the past I got been loners, but at the same time, it's really complicated. A lot of story to tell, but uh, it's not good when I have to bring uh, it in on social media all the times. I mean, uh, playing Vision of is actually nice. I got uh, the chance to actually uh, talk about some things that is actually fit to the topics. And um, sometimes you guys and girls get to know about me more, but at the same time, once people know about the truth, um, what's behind my past, people uh, were just gonna um, see me as a bad person. I mean, I'm already a bad person in the past, but sometimes in the future, I just want to be like, just um, forget about the past, just forget about everybody else, just be alone, think about this, and uh, uh, just think about what can I do better in the future, and I, I also got a feeling to respond, but when in the future they move on, people just gonna ignore it and they just you know, treat the people like, yeah, you serve yourself. It's a karma for uh, you doing bad things in the past. Just uh, leave it for the rest of your life and, uh, and think uh, about what you did in the past. Just, uh, it just. No matter what, how many times you say sorry, it just it's just a word, honestly, but it, it, it just never change. Yeah, I noticed that about you. Although I'm still I'm still curious why Yuri acted different after I joined. I talked to Sayuri and she says she noticed too. And uh, she probably has a crush on you. Wait, really you think? Obviously childhood friend. I mean probably. Why? Do you have a crush on her? Hmm no not really, I do have a crush, but it's not her. She's nice and all, but just not my type. You know, that type of girls who always like order too much food and then making the boy has to pay for everything. And uh, if I don't pay, and uh, she just gonna leave it and uh, leave me into a restaurant and just, uh, you know, send me into jail. I I never uh, been uh, to jail before, but it's just uh, an example anyway. But there will be always the type of people who does that, and uh, they uh, even also the types of girls uh, be like. Uh, they it just uh, broke up uh, instantly when boys don't pay for anything. But at the end of the day, again, the girls are uh, just gonna order a bunch of things and then force the boys to just pay them all, like cheat them, like, ugh. She nice and tall, uh, she nice and old, it's just not my type. I don't think she's tall, isn't it? So you do have a crush, who is it? I mean, she not tall. She, I mean, I'd rather not say, it's better for Natsuki to figure out about or by herself. I mean, we in a library together. Wasn't that obvious? Oh fine, keep your secret. We'll find out eventually. 
Sure, good luck. Aha, uh -huh, sure. Conversation chills out and Natsuki and I go back to our respective novels. I mean, come on. Natsuki, I think you already know what after what we did in the bento kitchen. <sighs> oh my god, it's so late. It's pretty dark outside. Does the parents worry? I look outside the window, seeing out the glowing moon. Yeah, it is cheese, it's only six. That's winter for you. Yeah. Hmm. I'll be heading out. Are we making more bento this Sunday? Oh, that's really nice, good idea. Yeah, definitely. That's good. I'll see you then, Natsuki. See you, iPhone. <sighs> wow, I wish. We wake up by and head off to our respective homes. My god, it's a good time with Natsuki. My god. Oh my god, is this something bad's gonna happen? Wait. I'm just gonna save it first. That's the music. But yeah, also, I'm uh, going to done in this episode. And I'm turning the music off. And I'm just gonna check the folder actually. If there's anything happens. Refresh. Nothing happens. Characters are still safe. My god. Alright. Holy. So. Yeah. I want to make a conclusion in this video. So I turned the music off for a reason. So yeah, I hope you guys think it's the mommy. But my god, the music. Is there something bad that's gonna happen? Also, yeah. The intros I made, uh, I made it. Don't blame to the games. Just take responsibility and be prepared for yourself. I mean, I can say that uh, 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 you actually be more responsible for yourself. However, that I cannot say that you don't play a game because I feel bad for the creator who made the mod. I also feel bad for um, people who created the original games as well. And uh, yeah, like I understand now uh, where, where the uh, game creator coming from. Yes, they want everyone to play the games. I mean, no matter on what age, but also they uh, having like uh, uh, their rules that trying to make sure that uh, there will be guidance, there will be age restrictions, and there will be uh, some uh, country that actually don't have the age restricted rules, like in Vietnam, and. Uh, Yes, unfortunately, Vietnam uh, is one of the countries that search the most uh, animation uh, animes because we don't have the age restriction rules. But, however, for uh, kids who are under 13 years old, please be prepared for yourselves. But also, uh, it's safe for having parent guidance as well because uh, sometimes uh, parents have to spend more time with the kids. Games are not the one to blame. They know uh, they will be uh, uh, unsuitable. Uh, stuff for children, but please just you know, spend th some time mo uh, mo more with them, okay? Just spend more time with them and uh, just you know uh, what you know, are they doing in their free times. I mean, uh, uh, sometimes you can not just ignore them, know their interests, trying to figure out what's going on, and be with them more. And then here we go. I mean, you'll be up a relationship as well as uh, trying to uh, make you know, your. Uh, children like feel that you are uh, uh, like uh, your interest even though you're not showing uh, it up like you uh, don't interest it that much but yeah also uh, that uh, I think Natsuki is uh, wrong but she uh, uh, can acknowledge it anyways she accidentally broke uh, Yuri's tea set but it's uh, mm, at the end of the day even though it's accident or not you had to pay for uh, the broken stuff, even though it's expensive or not. But uh, if you don't have enough uh, uh, money to pay, at least ask the parents if they don't uh, have enough. Uh, even with your parents, you can either find a part-time job, but if you don't have ability to do so, why cannot negotiate 
uh, as Yuri has mentioned, like, why not 50 50s? I mean, and then uh, just you, uh, you just don't need to actually pay instantly, you can just spend like months yeah, and then pay for the half, and then the next month you can pay for the half, which is uh, actually nice. I mean, uh, it's actually like you don't, don't need to cause argument, it's not gonna solve anything. It uh, can be work better in a smarter way, but yeah. And also, nasty feelings. Oh <sighs> my god. It hits me hard. Because I, rem uh, it's, I remember the time uh, when I was secondary school, I, even though I spent more time uh, with girls, like just uh, play with them, uh, like just a simple talking chit chat. Uh, but uh, however, it's not actually uh, we uh, talking about love stuff. We only talking about the interest like gaming and, uh, and uh, K-pop Korean uh, songs, uh, idols and stuff. Like in the past, I used to be uh, interested in uh, K-pop Korean uh, celebrities. I still am anyway, but uh, not much in the uh, K-pop songs. I'm sorry. I still like BTS though because. Uh, obviously, you uh, guys and girls, like, there's a gigantic fan base of BTS. If there's anyone saying bad stuff about uh, their favorite uh, idols, uh, the people just gonna curse you, like, for the rest of your life. I mean, other celebrities, they, they, do, uh, they you know, got affected the same things, and they don't know the uh, Korean cultures, and they just uh, have um, uh, the unnecessary outcomes. It just really sad and unfortunate. I don't think uh, what they did is wrong, but it's just the fan base is obviously. But yeah. Anyway, in uh, in secondary school, I'm uh, a big loner. I uh, I mean, now uh, every time I talk with girls and the boys, uh, they just uh, 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 kind of talking me. It's an easy target. It just um, easy for me to actually get bully, discrimination, slam, don't play. I mean, come on. I mean, even though I'm boy, and it doesn't mean that I'm playing with boy all the times. Can I at least having a normal time talking with girls without getting any misunderstanding on being in a love relationships? I mean, come on, we your classmates. Can we just treat you as a normal friend? Like come on, and uh, actually, yeah, I did uh, heard about the Me Too movement. Yes, I did uh, bad things for uh, uh, girls and women in the past, but mm, not to the point that I, I would say that is um act or a sound because yeah, obviously I'm young, but then I'm not allowed to do that, and obviously uh, in the future I won't anyway eh? because. Uh, everyone has a private life. I mean, nobody wants to leak in and um, uh, private stuff on uh, live anyway. But yeah, I mean, uh, of course, I'm uh, shy too. You can see me talking with girls, but it doesn't mean that I'm uh, confident all the times because I always uh, afraid there will be a misunderstanding and. Uh, uh, also, on the other hand, I also talk with boys too. I know there's uh, actually a uh, uh, good um, um, ex classmate who are boys back then. And then we also talk uh, to each other, even though not much. We uh, talk about gaming. But uh, it's just uh, at the end of the day, when we're growing up, we just uh, go uh, on a separate life and we're just losing friends and we're back to a lone life again. And uh, yeah. Even though that you uh, got uh, uh, social media uh, adding friends stuff, uh, it's, it doesn't mean that they're gonna you know, chat you uh, for the rest of life anyway. Uh, obviously. But yeah. Thank you guys and girls so much for watching. It's been so deep. And uh, uh, obviously, it's really nice when uh, playing visual novels and I get you know, a chance to talk about you know, the topics and uh, what I've been through when in the childhood when I used to be uh, in the secondary school and uh, I got more, actually more chance to expose myself, my bad self anyway and I got the chance to explain why I did this, why I realized the mistakes and what uh, I should do better and uh, obviously like uh, I did uh, 
um, I did say a lot that if I say you know, anything offensive, um, I want to apologize. But at the end of the day, that people always assume that I did nothing wrong. But still, I'm feeling guilty because you know, who knows? There will be a type of people who are trying to find my secret past and trying to expose it on social medias. Um, and then it just things gonna worse. I mean, I prefer to talk uh, about my bad self by myself. Uh, before uh, people gonna expose it to me because I acknowledge that uh, really well uh, and uh, uh, it just I know the consequence people gonna hate me afterward but uh, uh, yeah at the end of the day the most important thing is to be honest you don't let anyone to uh, uh, wait and for uh, your response and just don't wait for other people to actually expose for you but uh, yeah, for me, in my opinion, being honest is all that matter. But anyway, thank you guys and girls so much for watching. And as always, hasta la vista. Japan is an expensive country. I don't know if Nasuki gonna handle the, the teacups.